The first Battle of Cape Finisterre saw 14 British ships of the line under Admiral George Anson attack a French 30-ship convoy commanded by Admiral de la Jonquière during the War of the Austrian Succession. The British captured four ships of the line, two frigates and seven merchantmen, in a five-hour battle in the Atlantic Ocean off Cape Finisterre in northwest Spain. One French frigate, one French East India Company warship and the other merchantmen escaped. Events Prelude France needed to keep shipping lanes open in order to maintain her overseas empire. To this end she assembled merchantmen into convoys protected by warships. Anson on the Prince George and Rear Admiral Sir Peter Warren on the Devonshire had sailed from Plymouth on 9 April to intercept French shipping. When a large convoy was sighted Anson had made the signal to form line of battle. When Rear Admiral Warren, suspecting the enemy to be merely manoeuvring to promote the escape of the convoy, bore down and communicated his opinion to the Admiral, the latter threw out a signal for a general chase. Battle the Centurion under a press of sail was the first to come up with the rearmost French ship, which she attacked heavily and two other ships dropped astern to her support. The action became general when three more British ships, including the Devonshire, came up. The French, though much inferior in numbers, fought till seven in the evening, when all but two of their ships were taken, as well as nine East India merchantmen. The French lost 700 men killed and wounded, and the British 520. Over £300,000 was found on board the ships of war, which were turned into British ships. Aftermath following his victory, Anson was raised to the peerage. The French assembled another, much bigger, convoy which set sail in October. Hawke's defeat of this fleet in the Second Battle of Cape Finisterre put an end to French naval operations for the rest of the war. François de Grasse later, the famous Comte was wounded and taken prisoner as he served on La Gloire, which was captured. According to historian William Williamson, the battle was a most severe blow to the French interests in America. Besides immense property taken, there were found on board numerous articles designed for the Acadians and Indians who continued to resist the British in Acadia, Nova Scotia, order of battle. Britain Prince George 90 Vice Admiral George Anson, Captain John Bentley, Devonshire 66 Rear Admiral Peter Warren, Captain Temple West. Namor 74 Captain Edward Boscawen, Monmouth 64 Captain Henry Harrison, Prince Frederick 64 Captain Harry Norris, Yarmouth 64 Captain Piercy e. Brett, Princess Louisa 60 Captain Charles Watson, Nottingham 60 Captain Philip Saumarez, Defiance 60 Captain Thomas Granville, Pembroke 60 Captain Thomas Fincher, Windsor 60 Captain Thomas Hanway, Centurion 50 Captain Peter Dennis, Falkland 50 Captain Blumfield Baradell, Bristol 50 Captain William Montague, Ambuscade 40 Captain John Montague, Falcon 10, Vulcan 8, France Serieux 64 Captured, Invincible 74 Captured, Rubus 52 Captured, Jason 50 Captured, Glowy 40 Captured, Emero de 40, escaped. Chimere 36, escaped. Diamond 30, 56, captured, sunk later. Apollon 30, captured. Philibet 30, captured. Tetis 22, captured. Vigilant 20, captured. Modest 18, captured. Dartmouth 18, captured. Convoy of 24 ships or fewer, 6 captured.